The son of notorious drug kingpin El Chapo Guzman making his first appearance in a federal courtroom here in Chicago today. He's accused of carrying on the family business. WGN's Kelly Davis was there, has more from the Dirksen Federal Building. El Chapo's son was flown to Chicago on Friday, and today he stood before a judge and pled not guilty to all charges during his arraignment. Security was tight at the Dirksen Federal Building for Ovidio Guzman Lopez's first court appearance. Dressed in an orange jumpsuit and shackled at the ankles, the 33-year-old listened to the proceedings through a Spanish interpreter. He stood next to his attorney, Jeffrey Lichtman, who also led his father's criminal trial team. He's articulate, um, he's smart, and uh, he's, you know, I'm, I'm proud to represent him. Guzman Lopez faces a slew of charges, including drug trafficking, money laundering, and leading a criminal enterprise. The prosecution is seeking life in prison, agreeing to take the death penalty off the table. The evidence against the sons uh, is not necessarily the evidence against the fathers. Uh, the father's been in prison since, you know, it's been about eight or nine years by now, so things have changed dramatically in terms of the evidence. So I've got to review a completely different case. The indictments detail how Guzman Lopez and his brothers steered the cartel into synthetic drugs such as meth and fentanyl following their father's imprisonment in 2019. But the brothers have denied those allegations. There is a massive amount of discovery in this case, so I don't expect there to be um, motions anytime soon. I mean, eventually we'll make them when all the discovery has been reviewed, but at this point it's obviously very early. I haven't seen page one yet. Mexican officials captured Guzman Lopez in January, which set off a wave of violence that left 30 people dead, including 10 military personnel. On Friday, he was extradited to Chicago. In a statement, Homeland Security said it's, quote, a testament to the significance of the ongoing cooperation between the American and Mexican governments on countering narcotics and other vital challenges. Guzman Lopez is being held without bond pending his trial. The next court date is scheduled for mid-November. Reporting from the Dirksen Federal Building, I'm Kelly Davis, WGN News.